Hello, party people. Welcome back to Girl V. This is the place to be because today I'm making some quinoa pancakes because your girl's got a sweet tooth going on and we've got to sort it out so I'm making some quinoa pancakes I don't really want to go for anything processed because my belly is saying don't do it don't do it so I'm gonna try and be good and do something healthy but nice and sweet and just tickle the taste buds so I've grabbed some quinoa and I've blended that you don't have to you can just buy some quinoa flour and that's freeze-dried strawberry powder you haven't got to use none of that at all I've just put that in there because quinoa has got a strong grain taste so I'm trying to calm that down a little bit with a bit of strawberry um but I do go with the nutty flavor of quinoa anyway and I do add um almond extract and almond milk that is just a teaspoon of baking powder that I've added there guys and I do add a little bit of vanilla and a little bit of oil just to keep them moist you know what I mean because who want nobody nobody wants dry pancakes so we're gonna keep them moist and then we're gonna add that to the wet mister to our dry mixture and it was thickums thickums guys I'm not gonna lie she was thickums look you see what I mean and so I had to add some more milk so I've added some more milk to that um, and you can go 50 50 as well you don't have to go 100% quinoa you can go 50% regular flour especially if you're not used to quinoa do you know what I mean? All right, guys. Well, make sure you like, share, and subscribe. And I didn't put any sugar in, but you can put a bit of sugar in as well. Do Thank you. 